It's the final day of the competition and the turn of Ned and Bob to try for the £1,000 prize. Last night was uh, uh, very entertaining. The food, everything was a little bit overdone. This is going to sound so condescending, but it was a, it was a good attempt. So well done, but not well done? But who reckons they're doing well? Overall, definitely our menu and the effort and the entertainment that we all yeah. put together, I think I it would definitely be a five-star for, for us. Yeah. I very much hope that we are first at the minute. Yep. I don't mind coming second to uh, Bob and Nett. I'm sure that they're going to pull it out of that. I, I think... I do not want to come last to last night's meal. Any tricks up your sleeve, you two? I'm not going to use any witchcraft tonight to win this competition because our food... She still not need to, she's got me. <laughs> Oh, nice cackle. <laughs> On to the starter, then. By running wind and leaping fire, fish cakes and wine of desire. That sounds good. Had it before, have you? So sounds it's good a bit to be sassy, that, isn't fish it? cakes and wine sauce. I don't care what the food is. I'm <laughs> expecting a Shakespearean performance by Nat. Back in the kitchen, and Bob sets Nat a tricky task. The first test for you is find the lemongrass. So not that hard, really. Into the mixer go garlic, ginger, chopped chilli, coriander and sugar. Right, how many limes do you want in, Bob? The zest of two. Zest. Oh. Zest. Oh, where's your thing at? Zest. Lime zest now added. Bob throws in onions and beaten egg. Fish cakes and wine of desire. So, fish. Fish. <laughs> Yeah, that was not our desire. Bad luck, you two. The haddock is blitzed with all the ingredients. I think this is going to be the winning starter. And then formed into fish cakes. They'll shallow fry them later on. The hard work's done. Let's have some fun. Swoosh! I wonder if, we, when we turn up, they might dress up in, like, a wizard's outfit and a witch's outfit. Are you kidding? <laughs> Yeah, People quite possibly. This is in with a strong shout. It's exactly what I expected, to be fair. Um, and I'm sure it will be done well. Um, so this is competition. This is definitely mm -hmm. competition. Our night is going to be... Mystical. First to arrive for their evening of mystical mayhem, it's current leaders Lucy and Johnny. It's one of these jobs. Pagan. It's one of them pagan stars, isn't it? Yeah. Hello! Hello. Hi, Hi. Good, nice to to you. You. good to see you. Hi, yeah. Uh, there. Ladies first. Yep. Thank you. And enjoy. I said ladies first. And last but not least, Matt and Claire. Oh, a bit witchy. Hello. Hello. Hi, welcome. Come in. Hey, yeah, nice to see you right. again. Nice to see you. Yeah. All right. So, this is a Tibetan singing bowl. I just thought, just to bring some calmness to the evening. Cheers to that. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I like that. Right, last orders at the bar, guys. Whoa. Claire, respect the bowl, please. I think they nailed it. Say that after with the main three forces, please. <laughs> You've been telling me off all day, but you put out those I positive agree. Yeah, vibes. I agree, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, 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 and as they crack on with their fish cake starter... That one might not be a good one. Mm -hmm. There's a shock for the others. Look, Matt, she's nicked my broomstick. <laughs> Can we? No, you can't do that. You're meddling with forces you don't understand, Johnny. I'll get you, my pretty, and your little dog, too. <laughs> <laughs> she's a witch. I said she's a witch, didn't I? I yeah. think she's going to do a spell on us. I'll put a spell, spell on you. <laughs> I knew it. I knew Net were a witch. A good witch, bad witch? Good witch, of course she's a good witch. She's seen a lovely little face. So, a good witch. Time to see if the fish cakes have everyone under her spell. Come on, Bob, they're burning. Get them on that middle of that lace leaf, please. Mm -hmm. The final starter of the week. Save the best till last. Let's hope so. And there you have it. A Thai fish cake without any eye of newt or wing of bat, but with some lettuce. Thank you very much. No problem. Mm. Our starter this evening is... Can't remember, Bob. By running wind. By running wind. And leaping fire. And leaping fire. Fish cakes and wine. Fish cakes and wine. Of desire. Of desire. Please tuck in. Please tuck in and enjoy. Great work, Bob. Honestly, this is beautiful. Mm. Proper nice. I do love fish, 
but it's just a little bit... Fishy? Too fishy for me. You know what? I'm eating into that and I'm like, that is not so fishy. That was that was nice. That was tasty. Yeah. The herbs that they put into it, they heightened over the fish taste. I think that's what you didn't like. Yeah. yeah. Fish is fish. So, Nat, what's with the broom and things? I'm a practising witch and that's what we use to sweep away bad energies. I know you're a witch. I think I love you even more now. <laughs> but come on, who's got the best cackle? <laughs> Bit pirate of that one. Do you know why pirates are called pirates? Cos they are! Ha 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 ha! I think blokes do that, that ha 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 ha, because they can't. Yeah, it's definitely properly. more of a pirate. Yeah, more of a pirate. So, yeah, I seem to all enjoy it. I thought it could have gone better. I didn't get good vibes from around the table from the starter. I think they were just being polite. This does sound mysterious, spooky, supernatural. I've spotted that there's two tarot cards here, so there is something spectral going on. I actually feel a bit scared. Might not turn up. Well, I'm ready for my magical night tonight. I hope my guests are too. They'll be witcher in a minute. Yaggity yak, yaggity yak. Oh, first in its plate, liquor Paula. Yaggity yak, yaggity yak. Hiya! Hi! Good morning, it's Lovely so good to, to see you. Did you have a good night's sleep? No, I stayed out with the cows. They took me dancing. Right into a bit of rave they were. Whistles, lights. That's cows for you. <laughs> Right. Next up, it's Hassan. Hi. Hi. Come on in. It's really nice to see you. It's lovely to see you again. Evening. How are you doing? I'm good. Good, good. <laughs> <laughs> Great chat. Into the banter bungalow goes Sarah. Literally let me in. All right, she's coming. <laughs> Sarah, hi. hi. Come on in. <laughs> Nice to see you. Nice to see you. Can we get a drink? So, is this one of your signatures? It is one of my signatures. And I'm really happy to have found the glacé cherry. I am deducting you a point for not glassing them yourself. <laughs> oh! Making up the numbers, it's last night's host, Rod. Thank you. Come Feel amazing. Cocktail. Thank you. Here's to a magical, mystical night full of surprises. Cheers. 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 And Josie, put a bit extra on. I'm starving. It's night two of the competition in Sussex, where spiritual guru Josie Cheers. is hoping to conjure up a grand by hosting a supernatural supper in this deluxe dwelling. So, while she cracks on with the first course. Oh, wow. I oh love this. My. God, that's amazing. Sarah and Rod have a quick nosy at her knickknackery. Oh, my God, this is fantastic. When I walked in and saw Josie's table tonight, it was just nothing that I would be expecting uh, for a dinner party. Is she a witch? Do you think she's just, like, dead into Harry Potter? I don't think... This is beyond Harry Potter. You reckon? Isn't it? A little bit. Her menu sort of started to make sense, that the menu wasn't really about the food, it was about the evening. Best behaviour tonight, otherwise we're going to be frogs. Or yes. cooked up in a cauldron. Or a frying pan. Who said cooking was hard? Well, it's not if you're just frying some prawns and then plonking them on a fruity salad. I'm really happy with that. Let's get it on the table. The curiously titled Hanged Mango. Avocado and king prawn salad with sweet chilli sauce. And, of course, a tofu version for the non-meat eaters. Enjoy, everybody. I love the, the crunch and the texture to it. It's fantastic. I'm really pleased. Thank you. I really like the chilli. I mean, I'm chilli addict, so this oh, is perfect. Yeah, that's my kind of food. I ate every single scrap up. I absolutely loved it. When you said chilli, I thought, oh, OK, right, fair enough. And that, with the prawn, is gorgeous. This is delicious, Josie. I love it. Uh, a little bit basic, I think, um, if I'm honest, and a little bit easy. This table looks absolutely amazing. It's not what I expected, but what is it all about? What are you going to do to us? <laughs> <laughs> I've put you under my spell. <laughs> <laughs> there's two different sides to me. Uh, there's the very corporate, and then there's a very spiritual, Wiccan, pagan, tarot card reading, other side to Josie that I really wanted to bring out tonight. 
So who's riding home on the uh, broom tonight? Is it me or you? <laughs> Are you a witch? I'm not a witch, but I might make a quicker, a quick getaway on the broomstick. <laughs> when Josie started talking about her spirituality, it was quite brave to be open in front of new people about it, not knowing what the reaction would be. So do you know the lottery numbers? I do not know the oh. lottery numbers, no. <laughs> and if I did, I wouldn't share it. <laughs> oh, that's very spiritual. <laughs> I'm not against it, yeah. but I wouldn't go to a seance or play with these, what are these cards? Um, Tarot, yeah, tarot cards. cards or any of that. It's just, it's just not yeah. something I do. I knew she was, she was holding something back last night, but I was completely blindsided by that. I didn't see that coming at all. Just have your eyes open in everyday life and don't say, oh, that was interesting, and dismiss it. Yeah. Mm. For example, when I moved into my cottage, I have a pond, and on the day I moved in, all of the water in the pond just disappeared. It drained away. It's inexplainable. So then you have to ask yourself, why did the water drain away? Maybe the previous owner pulled the plug out or something? I don't know. Did you pay the bill? <laughs> Maybe it was that. <laughs> <laughs> Things happen, you know. Some days my toilet flushes and some days it doesn't. There's no reason. Might have something to do with cheese. <laughs>